Hello, welcome to Beth Roars, where we look at your favourite singers to find out what makes them them. Before we start, you can find me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. My handle is at Beth Roars and I hold loads of votes on my Instagram so you guys can vote on who I react to. Also, please do check out my website, BethRoars.com, where you can book a singing lesson from me. And last but not least, please do head over to my Patreon, which is Patreon.com slash Beth Roars, where you can get some more exclusive content, you can get early access to my podcast and you can find out a little bit more about my scholarship fund for aspiring artists. This one has been asked for loads in the comments and you'll see why in a moment. He took a big breath. Cheesy. That was crazy long. That was awesome. That was awesome. So how do you do a big long note like that? I can understand why everyone's like, ah, because it's wicked. You need to breathe. I know it's so simple. But you need to breathe in a relaxed way. That's really the key. Often what people do when they try and breathe, they try and suck in the air. <gasps> and actually, this tension is hindering your rib cage. You need it to be relaxed, like when you're sleeping or like when you see babies sleep. A good thing to think about as well is that the rib cage will expand 360 degrees. That's into your back as well. Now, remember, your heart sits at the front of your body and your lung tissue, there's actually more at the back because the heart is filling up the space at the front. So breathing into your back can be really, really helpful. This is incredible. He's hardly singing, he's just speaking and not over singing at all. Here he goes again. <laughs> oh my god. Another thing to think about with long notes is how much breath you're expelling. So he, his tone is full, he's got full chord closure. It's not a breathy sound. If he had a breathy sound, that would be almost impossible. Once you get the correct placement of sound, once you get that kind of clear tone, often you don't need as much breath as you think. <laughs> I don't know what he's saying, but it seems pretty, uh... It's hurting him real bad. It's like his voice is breaking from emotion. I'm just going to point out, this is an A, this is often a really difficult note for men, it's kind of a break between mix and head voice, but getting up to that note on a slide after that long note and it just be so sustained and easy sounding, this is incredible work. I knew who he was, I just didn't realise he could sing, that's good. Shame on me for not knowing more about this guy before. 
día tan distinto, algo hermoso, algo divino. Now he's a natural tenor, you can hear this high stuff is easy for him. And he's really using the rhythm to change it up. Pero no de soledad. Te soy muchas cosas más. Yo jamás sufrí. Okay, there's another really interesting fact about Anthony. He had a stutter as a kid, and when he sung, his stutter went away. There's loads of science behind it. I actually did a podcast on it, so go check it out. I talked to a beatboxer who works with people with stutters to help them with their stutters. And Mark Anthony here found singing as his refuge when he was really struggling to communicate. You were muy feliz. Listen to the crowd, it's mad. Is that a kangaroo? You can tell it's so easy for him. He's so used to singing. He can be wandering around thinking of other things and the song will just pour out of him. It's fantastic how easy it is. And that allows him to just be a showman, just enjoy his time on stage. He's so comfortable there. And he's just constantly hitting these high notes and I... And enjoying it. Hasta que vi la vida con dolor. No te miento, fui feliz. Aunque con Was that his kid? I don't know. It's really, really cute. I thought it was really nice. One thing I also really like about him, I did a little bit of research before I did this video and I found out that he had opened up an orphanage in Colombia. So he really does some really nice work as well as just being a singer, which loads of people love. <laughs> So emotional and fun and I like these where it's kind of so these where he kind of makes it into a shout rather than is purposefully not sitting on the note. He kind of scoops up to it. Last minute you get that moment of like, oh is he gonna make it? Ah oh, yes he does, and then it's like way I like it. Great when you can kind of use the band. Oh, and I love a sing along.
look, I'm going to point out, one, his performance is incredible, but two, the whole way through this, I know the start really made it obvious, but you can see even here, his breathing is great, his support is great, it's so relaxed, you don't really see him do a <gasps> breath at any point, it's he just allows that breath and then his tone is clear, crystal clear, he's not escaping any air, very good. Sounds pushed, it's nice and relaxed. Oh. And he's sassering around as well. How awesome is he? As I said, shame on me for not knowing more about this guy. He's absolutely wicked. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.